Hey guys, what's going on? I'm Radizio and welcome to today's video. As the title suggests, we are going to go diamond hunting. First of all, let me get some of this wood right here. I suggest you get around 16 wood logs or so that when we go mining, we have a decent amount of wood with us. All right, and thanks to the editing tricks that I've got up my sleeve, that shouldn't take too long at all. All right, not too shabby. Now that that's done, let's have a look around to see where the lowest piece of land is where we can get to. So, as of today, we're going to be going trench mining or vein mining as you may call it. It's not the regular cave mining that you are probably used to, where you just head on down into a cave and find diamonds every so often. No, today we're actually going to be digging trenches at a level of 11 through 12. What am I doing right there? I'm talking and thinking and I shouldn't be doing both at the same time. Right, I just did it again. Why did I do that? Right, let's take that with us. And I'm just looking to get around six cobblestone so that we can make two little pickaxes which we can mine our way down with and hopefully we might actually get some iron on the way which wouldn't be too bad all right there we are now let's make two two of these there we go take this one with us so as i was saying we're going to be heading down to level 11 and 12. that is where diamonds will be spawning in the game now actually diamonds spawn from a level 5 through 12. Now you might ask why don't we go any lower then? Well it's just as simple as saying that on the lower levels Minecraft actually spawns in lava pools. So the top of the lava pool, the lava source block, will actually be spawning in um, level 10. So that's why we actually want to stay on 11, 11, level 11. Wow those are real tongue twisters. So that we don't accidentally run into lava. Now let me check out and see where we are already. We're at a level of 50. We're gonna head on down quite a bit more. And I know digging straight down isn't really optimized for mining. I know you should actually be digging like this, but for the sake of this video and saving some time, I'm just going to be heading straight down and hopefully I'm in luck today, as we will indeed be needing some luck to find those diamonds. Right, not too shabby, some more iron that we can take, which will be pretty handy if we get down there to be able to make our iron pickaxe. Now, just around 10 more levels to dig straight down. We're at 20. All right, so as you can see, we are now at level 11. Those are our X, Y, Z coordinates. Our X and our Z are our first and our last. Now the 11 coordinate is actually corresponding to the block we are in right now. So that corresponds to this block right here. The block where our head is at, that is actually level 12. So now that we've got that out of the way, let me make ourselves a little room here to make a little crafting bench, a furnace or two. Now it's actually been a really long time since I've played Minecraft. So I'm actually looking forward to making some kind of a let's play series. Let me know is, if that is something you want to be seeing from me or either it be some other type of mod pack. Just let me know in the comments below and I'm sure to read all of your comments and I will reply to as many of them as I can. Now the ordinary way of doing this would be by digging a two by one trench like this. Now this isn't really optimized for the time we have. So I'm going to show you something new that's new in the game. There we go, we're gonna make ourselves four trap doors and I hope we've got our iron. Yes, we do indeed. We're going to make two more pickaxes which we'll use to dig up our diamonds, hopefully if we get any. So going to start our trench right here, place the trap door on the side and when you do that and close it down onto yourself, we're actually going to go in a crouching position or whatever you may call it. Wait, let me, um, yeah, so that's pretty weird, I know, but yeah, 
<laughs> All right, so now that that's done, you can see we only have to mine in a one by one area, which will greatly reduce our amount of pickaxes that we'll have to go through. And of course, also the time that we need to spend mining. I should actually have brought some torches with me. So let me head back quite quickly and get me some coal right there. How much should we need? Around 80 would be fine, right? 64, there we go. Now, the advantage of doing this is that, you see that we only have to break one block, which then shows us one, two, three, four more blocks. And if you wanna count the behind block in as well, that's actually five blocks that you are able to see per block that you break. And in the other way where you dig a two by one hole, you will have to break two blocks to reveal six blocks. Two on the left, two on the right, and one top and one on the bottom. So as you can see, that is why we did this. And here we go. That's how easy it is to find diamonds in using this method. Hopefully it is more than one. You always wanna make sure that you open up the whole patch of diamonds so that it doesn't accidentally fall into lava because this is of course quite a bit of work to find these. We don't wanna let them go to waste so easily. All right, I think this is a great amount of diamonds and that actually proves my point. Of course, there had to be lava there, which again proves my point that we wanna dig out everything we can. There we go. Let's light this up. I wanna be really careful now that I know that there is lava here and maybe we'll close that off. I just wanna make sure that there isn't any lava down here as well. All right, let's break that and put some more cobblestone down. But it should be fine, I guess. So here we go, that's two, three, four, five. Six diamonds, that is a real honor that that was able to happen so quickly. So guys, I guess that was all there was to show in this video. I hope it did help. If it did, please make sure to leave a comment and say how many diamonds that you found using this method. Of course, leave a like if you like this video and subscribe if you wanna see more. But for now, I'm Redizio and I'm out.